Welcome back to Afternoon Express. Now, considering our pets are part of the family, it's only fair that they enjoy the same quality food that we do. Well, that's the theory anyway. And our very own Clem and his beautiful pup Nessie are starring in a new campaign. Let's see what it's all about. I'm Clem Pedro, and this is Nessie. Just like a dad, you can't keep Nessie out of the kitchen. And it seems to be where we spend most of our time. When it comes to cooking for your family, quality is essential. Cook with as many locally sourced products as possible, with the highest quality meat proteins. The secret to a delicious and nutritious meal is cooking it naturally low and slow, locking in all those nutrients and tasty flavors. Following these golden rules, you're guaranteed to have a mouth-watering and healthy meal for your whole family, including your very best friend. Petley's Gourmet Meaty Meals, prepared with the same passion, care and process as you would for your own family. Okay, that's a really cute dog. She's really special though. Oh, yeah. so sweet. Okay, so tell me more. Okay, so I really am obsessed with Petley's and the reason is the same quality that goes into the food that we prepare on our show yeah. and at home is actually put into every single can of Petley's. Yeah. So for the little ad that you saw, we made a beautiful oxtail dish and I actually want to recreate it today in the studio. Oh, that's yeah. amazing. I've always loved making really delicious food for my dogs, but then I broke up with them soon afterwards. <laughs> <laughs> okay. okay, so what do we got here? Because to start up with the oxtail, very important, yeah. you always brown off the oxtail and that way you get that intense, nice flavor. Yeah. So to that, we're gonna go with some caramelized onions and, well, when it comes to oxygen, you know the trick is low and slow, right? Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Slow cooking, slow. So this is all slow food movement here. Yes, it is. And the same, that low and slow technique is also used with pickles. Yeah. You know what I mean? To bring out the natural flavors of the ingredients. You're not yeah. adding any funny bits to it. And in your commercial, you also sounded low and slow. I think that it was, was like the sexy Clem voice, I hey? think that's just how I cook at home, you know? <laughs> a little bit, of, little bit of music in the background. It's just like cooking. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> All right, so that fried up nicely. Some yeah. caramelized onions went in there, and now we're gonna go with our like our mirepoix. So it's our carrots and also mirepoix. Mirepoix. I've never heard that word in my life. At home, I also speak French. What's a mirepoix? Mirepoix. It's basically our base vegetables that you actually okay. add to so every then that's single. That. There we go. Carrots, celery. Here we go. Sorry, Here that's go. leeks, yeah. And then the celery, I've got it with it on the side. I'll just chop up real quick. There you go. Just like that. Mirepoix. Mupa. That's really nice. Yeah, yeah. And of course, if you want all of the recipe details for this fantastic slow cooked, what's it, lamb shank? It is our oxtail. Oxtail, oxtail. Oh, well, I thought it was a lamb shank. So, what you need to do is SMS the keyword lamb to double three six five zero, and they will send you all of the details that you'll, that you'll need your shopping list, the step by step how to, so that you can make this. Ooh, very, very mm. yummy dish. There we go. Okay, that looks amazing. Mm -hmm. So this oxtail is look, looking amazing right now. There we go. So another reason I've also chosen Petley's is because with the other commercial brands that are out there, you actually don't know what's in there. You yeah, don't. True. So with Petley's, guaranteed, there's, it's proper meat protein and meat, like oxtail. If it says oxtail in the can, it's definitely oxtail that they're using. A lot of the other brands seem to use other cereals, which is not recommended for your pets at all. Yeah. So definitely choosing pet is guaranteed a higher protein diet for your little furry friend sure. at home. Totally. There we go. Just like there that. There you go. Oh, Clem, that looks amazing. Some homemade beef stock. That's yeah. going to start simmering away nicely. Just like that. And then I've got some tomato paste, and that's just going to add that nice richness Delish. to our oxtail. Mm, I love tomato paste. Mm -hmm. And it just makes all the difference. Yeah. There we go. So let's plate this guy up. So I kind of went a little fancy. I do cook fancy at home. Yeah. I kind of let my little... <laughs> Speaks French, cooks fancy. Oh, what is background that? Background music. This is our carrot and leek puree. Very Ooh. simple. Carrots, leeks, a little bit of butter, a little bit of cream cheese yeah. pureed. Beautiful color, and there's like nothing added to it. This is natural, natural color. Oh, you never cease to amaze me. Again, it's keeping... just magic in a kitchen, don't you think? It is. There we Ooh, go. Yum. A little bit of that puree going down. Let me just swap it out to show you. After we've cooked it for about four hours, yeah. that meat is just falling off the bone. So there we go. Clem. Just like that. Oh, what do you think? A little bit of that garnish. That looks delicious. Just like the one that we've done right over there. Mm. And it's done. We're eating. Look at that. Oh, I 
absolutely love it. Now, if you have a pet in your life, it is so, 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 so important to feed them with the love and care that you do for yourself. And it's so great to see a company like Petley's providing our pets with yummy and really meaty meals. Really love it. And if you uh, like to get Clem's really delicious slow-cooked oxtail recipe, then you can find it on the link. Uh, all you need to do is, all you need, it's, it's promeal.co.za forward slash brands forward slash Petley's. There you go. <laughs> Welcome back. We're on the couch with Mark and Lover. So you win this competition yes. and you host the Global Grand. What are some of the biggest lessons that you learned? Hmm. The biggest, one of the biggest lessons I learned was that you have to fight for your own dream. I mean, winning the competition was just one step of it, but I right. had to actually make contacts and find ways to get on the red carpets and interview these celebrities. And when that wasn't enough, find a way to actually monetize it on my own away right, from Global Grind. Right. So that was a huge challenge for yeah. me. Yeah. And what role did social media play in that process? And, and what are the most significant lessons that you've learned on how social media can impact one's career, especially globally? Right. The fact that I'm sitting on this couch with you is proof yeah. that it's not just social media. Yeah. Social media has been amazing in the way that I've been received just in South Africa or throughout the continent because it's given people a chance to get to know me, to see me, and for me to show my personality and show what I'm doing and really connect with people. So Absolutely. I just love social media. Yeah. Absolutely. Huge proponent. It's like, don't yeah. sleep on social media. Yeah. And I mean, now you've, you've grown into this big global brand, but it still it seems like it's very important to you to keep this connection with Africa, yeah. with South Africa. What yeah. are some of the uh, networking um, relationships that you still have with South Africa? Well, I think just based on social media, yeah. I've been able to take that and build solid in-person, in real-life relationships, which is why it's important for me to come here and meet with people and talk to them and really solidify those relationships outside of social media. Mm -hmm. But people have been so instrumental in just even recommending me for jobs or other yeah. various writing opportunities as well. Because the thing about this industry is you can't be a one, what is it, one trick pony or just do yes. one thing you have to be versatile and do many different things Absolutely. so the contacts that I've gotten from social media have actually translated into real life in South Africa wow. real life money wow. in my bank account yeah. yeah you've interviewed some of the biggest names the Tyler Perry's mm -hmm. um, so many mm -hmm. and what what stands out for you about big names that perhaps people find still find so intimidating what what makes them human for you every time you meet them yeah a couple of things how human they are because when you see people and you watch them on tv i'm sure you can relate to this people have this view of who you are but at the end of the day you're just bonnie you're just like a yeah, regular person yeah. who just happens to have an amazing job an mm -hmm. amazing opportunity mm -hmm, right mm -hmm. so you realize that they're just human beings yeah. but the other thing that i'm struck by is that people are so fascinated by the fact that i am african each celebrity that i have talked to, whether it's John Legend or Tashina Arnold or Raven Simone, when I say just my name, they're like, oh, where are you from? Yeah. And then the conversation goes a different way. I'm like, no, 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 no. This is not about me. This is about you. <laughs> so that sense of uniqueness yeah, is absolutely. so important in whatever industry you're in. Yeah, that's incredible. So yeah. now you host Essence Now. I did. What does a day in your life look like? Oh my gosh, crazy. It's never the same. Manic. Super hacked. Super hectic, yeah, it's manic, but it's fun. It is the job of a lifetime. Like, I still, I'm just like glowing in that photo because every time I get to go to work and represent this huge iconic brand, and the fact that they picked me, Aww. little old me from Zimbabwe, who like fought and hustled for her dream, the fact yeah. that they picked me, I feel like I am floating. It's it's unreal. It's 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 truly a dream job. Yeah. Well, congratulations. You're not Thank going you. anywhere. We're gonna have these two amazing women back on the couch after the break with more from Marco. And we're joined again on the couch by Trending Essay co-host Cooley Roberts. And we'll yeah. see you right after this.